Não faz mal. Não, não tem problema, ok? Alright, guys, então, vamos começar a lesson 21, o exercise book. Everybody there? Good. So let's see. This is the example I gave you to be allowed to. This is the grammar point here. Okay? So to be allowed is the same as to have permission. When somebody permits you to do something. Example here in the classroom, we're not permitted, as she mentioned, we're not permitted to use the phone, we're not permitted to smoke, and many other things. Okay? So according to this example, I'm going to ask Camila. Camila, at what age are we allowed to vote in Brazil? We are allowed to vote in To vote? It's an election. For example, I voted for PT, PMDB, Lula, Dilma, so... What do you say? Okay. Uh, mandatory. Obligation. At what age? 18. Very good. Number three goes to uh, Nanda. At what age are you allowed to drive a car in Brazil? You are allowed to drive at 18 years old. 18 years old? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Good. Uh, Lorena, at what age are we allowed to marry? <laughs> yes. Really? Really. Okay, she has the information. Uh -huh. Although we marry whenever we want, quando a gente quer, no problem. But uh, according to the Catholic Church, right? É, cartório só pode ter 16. Ah, according to cartório, we can be married at age 16? Yeah. Good. Right, and the last question is, at what age are you allowed to buy alcoholic drinks in Brazil? 18 to? Mm -hmm. That's it, very good. Now, use the question tags. I don't know if you remember, but the, the idea is, when I say, the first example, she studies and we need a confirmation, okay? For example, uh, we, we say here, question tag. I like to say that the question tag in Brazil is the confirmation né, okay? So, uh, then, I have some steps to follow. Example, she studies. What I do first is I put the personal pronoun in the end, okay? And then I have to identify the verb. What tense is this verb? Present, future, or past? It's present, right? Okay, so what is the auxiliary verb that represents the present? Mm -hmm. Does she? Okay. No problem, right? So this is the idea. So let's see. First one, she studies very hard. Uh -huh. Actually, I made a mistake, I'm sorry. It's doesn't she. Okay? Because here we have the positive verb and the confirmation will be in the negative. <laughs> Just like it in English. Okay? So let's see number two. They drive drugs. What do you think? <coughs> Don't they? Uh -huh. Remember? Good. Number three. We aren't angry at me. Are you? Are you? Very good. They spoke with their manager. What do you think, Camila? Thank you. 